Lindsay. Welcome to the Horseplay Interactive Gallery at the National Museum of Racing and Hall of Fame. Normally, we would have you guys come visit us here to explore and learn all about thoroughbred racing. But since we can't do that right now, we decided to make some fun videos for you instead. Here at the museum, our mission is to preserve and promote thoroughbred racing. One of the ways we do that is to teach kids like you about thoroughbred horses. These videos are going to focus on the life cycle of a thoroughbred racehorse. Do you know what a life cycle is? A life cycle shows the breakdown of different stages of life. You have a life cycle too. Right now, you're a child. Before, you were a baby. And pretty soon, you'll be a teenager. Keep watching to learn all about foals from our friend Shaleen. A thoroughbred is a horse breed known for racing. They have great speed and swiftness. Here is a photo of a racehorse. The first life stage is when they are foals. Let's learn more. A baby horse is called a foal. Here are photos of foals. Girl foals are called fillies, and boy foals are called colts. When you were first born, you were called a baby. Thoroughbred horses are mammals. A mammal is a warm-blooded animal with a backbone that feeds its young, which are born live, with milk produced by the mother, and has skin covered with hair. Here are photos of foals drinking milk from their mare, its mom. Do you know any other mammals? What are some examples? That's right, humans. You are also a mammal, just like a horse. When you were a baby, you were fed with milk, also like foals. The mare will usually deliver her foal at night Nighttime delivery stems from when horses were in the wild, and darkness gave the foal protection from danger. Under the cover of night, the foal has time to stand and drink milk, another throwback to nature when those quick to move survived. After a foal is born, the mare will bond with her new baby. These are pictures of foals minutes after they were born. After a human baby is born, the parents will also bond with their new baby by holding and touching it. Let's watch a video of a foal right after birth. The foal is working to stand up. The mare is licking her foal. Licking is one of the first signs of mare and foal bonding. This is important in stimulating the foal and drying it off. The mare encourages the foal to stand, which will help it to get closer to drinking milk. Here is a foal as it stands for the first time. The foal is gaining strength and balance in its legs. A foal will generally stand within one to two hours after birth. This is a photo of a foal as it first stands. Do you know how long it took for you to stand and walk? Take a guess. Then check with an adult. Babies usually stand at around nine months and start walking between 12 and 15 months. So it's pretty amazing that foals start to walk within a couple hours after being born. Once the foal has gained strength in its legs, it will look for milk. In the first 18 to 24 hours, the foal will drink the first milk produced by the mare. This milk contains the most nutrients. This sculpture titled Mare and Nursing Foal by Harry Lamontag shows a foal drinking milk. It is an object at the museum that shows the horses in a solid form using plaster. This foal is starting to drink milk. The first milk from the mare is really important as it has the most nutrients 
and helps to build immunity. Immunity is the ability to fight off diseases. The first milk will help to develop immunity in the fall until it is four to five months old. Following the delivery, a veterinarian or animal doctor will come to examine the foal and make sure the baby is healthy and drinking milk. Then the foal will be weighed and measured to track its future growth. Foals are usually 100 to 150 pounds at birth. After a baby is born, a doctor will weigh and measure it to see how it grows. Human babies are usually 6 to 10 pounds at birth. How much did you weigh as a baby? Take a guess and then check with an adult. Over the next few weeks and months, the mare and foal bond outside in a fenced-in area or paddock, like in this picture. The foal will also be handled so that it becomes comfortable being touched and groomed by people at the farm. Next, let's watch a video of a mare and foal coming in after being out in a paddock. The foal is getting more comfortable being touched and handled by people. So on our way into the stall here, you can see the blankets we have on these guys on cold days. It was 24, 26 this morning and the wind was blowing, the wind's still blowing. So we put these blankets on just because these babies don't have the body mass, their core temperature isn't great. And you can see this foal just, just a couple days old here. It's pretty comfortable with handling, get the blanket on and off, being touched all over, you know, with, with one person. Now some of them, this colt's got a great temperament. Some of them are a little more skittish and, and don't like all that. Um, but he's pretty good and pretty trusting, and that's the kind of relationship we want. That's what we want these foals to be comfortable with us and that whatever we're bringing them is going to be okay. Because if we do our job well that way, we've got that willing partner. We've got that partnership that is what we want that makes that horse a better racehorse down the road when he's got that trust and confidence in himself and in his handlers. Hi. So we're going to do an activity today that's going to involve our full patrol coloring book. So what you want to do is we have some different sheets that I'll be reading and showing you that you can color. You can download them with the link that we provided. And then you also want to just grab some materials like crayons are great. I love crayons, um, markers, color pencils, anything like that to use. So we're going to um, read a couple of these pages and it'll be a nice summary of what we've learned today from our program. So, the mare is in foal for 11 months before she has her baby. When a mare gives birth first, she cleans her baby by licking the foal. We learned about that. This does more than just clean the baby. It also stimulates it and provides the first bonds with its mother. The weight and height of the foal are measured at birth. So there's a, an illustration of that. Great to color in. The colt, or boy foal, um, or filly, the girl foal, can stand within one hour of being born. They can run within a few hours after birth. Horses are mammals and nurse their young within the first two hours. The mare's milk contains needed antibodies or nutrients so that the foal can fight infection. The veterinarian comes and examines the mare and foal to make sure that they are healthy. The vet listens to the foal's heart with a stethoscope. Normal heart, heart rate for newborns are 60 to 120 beats per minute. So that's just an interesting fact about, about foals. And our last page. So soon after the foal is born, the mare and the foal are led out to a field where they can exercise and play. This makes their bones strong. So there's a, a drawing of that. One more page in this book that's pretty fun is that we have a maze, so a full patrol maze. 
And exactly, we want to help the foal find its way back to the mare or the mom. So we'll have this sheet so that you can download it and you can fill it out and see if you can figure out the path, figure out the maze to help the foal get back to the mom. So after our program today, what were a few things that you learned? It would be great if you could share with a friend or a family member what a foal is and also what are some ways that um, a mare bonds with her foal. Hi everyone, hope you had a lot of fun today and learned all about foals. Come back next Wednesday for our next video in this series. You'll learn all about weanlings, the next stage in a thoroughbred's life. If you have any questions at all or would like to learn more about the education department here at the National Museum of Racing and Hall of Fame, feel free to reach out to me. My email is listed right below. Have a great day and see you next week.